tiny kitten is now on the mend and a Chester County resident facing multiple charges in connection with what the Brandywine Valley SPCA is calling a heinous case of animal abuse. It all started with the report of a stray dog when a person with a maimed kitten approached the SPCA asking for help. Our Don Timoney picks up the story from there. She was wrapped in duct tape and was missing, you know, her, her front leg and we're not sure what happened. The five week old kitten now named Rue in bad shape when she was handed over to the Brandywine Valley SPCA's humane law enforcement last week. The one and a half pound kitten rushed to BV SPCA's Westchester facility for emergency treatment. She was running a fever. She was had, you know, her wound was was exposed. Our vet was able to do life saving surgery and she pulled through it, which was a miracle in itself. The BV SPCA says when it's animal protective services officer returned to the home the next day with Coatesville police to arrest the owner. They found dozens more animals living in deplorable conditions. 36 cats. There was a deceased kitten. Some of them have uh, eye infections. Some of them have upper respiratory infections. There was also a rabbit, a turtle, and a dog named Gucci, who Cheryl Moore is fostering. He's very scared, very scared of loud noises. Um, so it's just letting him decompress and letting him settle in. Some of the cats have already found homes. Others, like this pretty girl right here, are up for adoption. And still other kitties are waiting to be medically cleared before they're able to find their forever homes. If they want to help in another way, they can make donations. You know, there's a lot of cost involved in all of this. And we really appreciate the, the community rallying to support Rue and all of these survivors. As for sweet little Rue, she's doing amazingly well. While she's not out of the woods, Woods yet she is getting stronger every day and being nursed back to health in a loving foster home. She's our little heroine. I mean, if it wasn't for Rue, who knows what would have kept going on inside that house. And now these animals are going to be in a better place and they're going to have nice, warm, healthy homes. And, you know, it's just a better life for them. Dawn Timoney, Fox 29 News. Aww.